It's very dark, so I don't think we'll pick much up. Well, I can see it, but I don't think uh, the camera will pick it up. Mm -hmm. It's too dark. Too dark. <laughs> Is it twins? <laughs> Is it twins? <laughs> So we know it's a boy. That's the balls, that's the bird. Yeah, there's, there's no mistake it's in that. Boy. Yeah, there's no mistake in it's a boy, is it? It's in the right position now. Yes, so well, because we saw the balls here, yeah. therefore the head is here. Yeah, because okay. before it was before. breech, yes. very, very much breech, wasn't it? It was totally wrong way around. In my experience, more than 80% would just turn around. Turn around on their own, yeah. What about this size of the head, Doctor? Is that normal? The size of the head? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I, I would think so. I, say. I, mean, I do this all the time. I do this uh, almost every day. We have to, uh, no. we have to measure the... Uh, Sixty-six then, pirayan then. Male pala ako then, baby boy. Normal fluid, fundal posti... Opo, fundal posterior. One. One to two muna, normal fluid. Sa palit. Because there's a history in your family of that, uh, was it with a big head? Ah, uh, hydrocephalus? Yeah, yeah, this... Opo, no, 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 this one is off. Yeah. You would see that. But some would develop after birth. Really? Doesn't doesn't mean that you have a normal at birth. You can have development of hydrocephalus after birth. It takes a long time. It's a more gradual enlargement. So normally pag pag inaki mo yan, normal. Normal mo yan. It doesn't develop the big head in the womb. It's when they, they, they go out. So when they, oh. they are outside or they So there's absolutely n not no, normally no. any signs until the baby's born? Yes. Oh. yes. Sometimes you see some signs like for example uh, inside the brain you have uh, like this one. You know those black that thing there? Yeah. Those are those 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 would contain fluid. Right. Uh, no, but uh, when there's uh, something abnormal, something blocking, it, it's supposed to circulate inside the brain and then down the spine and then up the brain, like like that. And then when there's a blocking somewhere, you would see ballooning inside. But since this is a baby inside the womb, you don't see enlargement of the head right. yet. Yet, okay. Yet, uh, but there are no signs. Mm -hmm. Oh no, no. That's good. Everything looks uh, fairly symmetrical. Yeah. Mm. So it's it's uh, it's fairly easy to compare the the structures of the brain because it's like a mirror. You split it in half, and then the opposite side looks like this one. I see. So, but mm. this one looks like it's uh, okay. Very good. So it looks like a healthy young man. Yep. Yeah. Oh, this is metal, sorry. <laughs> I was just saying, knock on wood. <laughs> so we will make an estimate of the weight. This is uh, 
well, the computation says it's close to like 80 to 85 percent of the actual weight. And then you also have to give time for some, still some growth because. Pira mm -hmm. ako then. 66. You're only about 33, 34 weeks. So technically, you still have about six weeks till your you know, due date. Mm. So uh, six weeks time, you, you can expect some some growth. My God, there's no room for any more growth in that belly, is there? Uh, okay. <laughs> Tapos then 88 ang uh, abdomen, BPD I uh, 87 halos kras. Kung ano, uh, ano mo, then it's still with long weight. May kanang minus. Wag na po. Wag na. Ano pa ng third yan? So, everything looks okay. Tapos yung placenta naman is nasa taas, nasa may, actually nasa baba siya, hanggang doon sa may taas pa niya. So that's very important if you plan to uh, deliver in a small setup, like a small clinic. Mm -hmm. uh, the placenta is normal in location. It's not blocking the way out of the base. It's not round the neck or anything no, like that. I, well, yeah. I don't see one right now. Mm -hmm. Sometimes that happens during labor. Right, right now I don't see any, anything that would suggest something uh, with a cord around the neck. Yeah, I don't want any stress, okay? I want a stress-free birth. <laughs> Scared? I've yeah, heard it's just like shelling peas. Yeah, the, the hospital will be the safest and a place to give birth, especially on the first born. Yeah. Oh, I would always. Uh, okay, lang if it's the, sec the third or the second, the fourth, the same experience can I. But you know, a lot of people are still giving birth sa our deliverance sa mga small, small uh, birthing you know, places. But it's still safe for us. So how many pounds do you think it is, Doctor, uh, at the minute? My, my secretary would compute that. Uh, mm. we, we, we take the measurement of the head and the abdomen and then the length of the bone, the thigh bone. And then we're, there's supposed to be a formula that tells you how much in pounds and kilos. All right. It will be uh, placed in the report. And it looks uh, fairly big. Wow. Yeah, the big daddy. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> okay, Paul. Okay, na Paul. Lions roaring in the morning sun, searching for a longer day. People feeling like the light has just come. We must never stop the way. Yeah. But jumping and I hear my name. Savannah <laughs>